Welcome to Sharing Creativity and Company. My name is Sharon Chang, and I'm going to share with you today how to make the cute little basket for this Easter Bunny project. The Easter Bunny is on another video, and I'll be sharing the link for that. But in the meantime, this basket can be used for a lot of different things. It's actually made with the envelope punch board. Let's get started. First thing you're going to do is you're going to cut a sheet of designer series paper six by six. Then you're going to come in at the one and one quarter inch mark, which is right here, and you're going to punch and score. And I'm just going to put the tip right in there and pull down, and you can see that there's a score mark. Come to three and three quarters, punch again, score. And then what you're going to do is you come in and you line up the score mark with this little pointer. So you don't measure from here again. And again, you're going to punch, score, come over to the next score mark, and you're going to punch, and score. You're going to do that to all four sides, and then you're also going to round the corners on all four sides just like that and you punch and there you go. I've already got the sample where I've done that for you. And here's what you have. Go ahead and fold on all the lines. Then what you're going to want to do is you're going to this is what I call the wide tab. You can see it's wider. You're going to cut to the fold lines. and You're going to do that on both sides. These little tabs you can go ahead and take your adhesive and go ahead and put them down like that. And now I'm going to tell you that if you're going to decorate this box, this is the time to decorate it. It's much easier because it's flat um, before you stick it together. Ask me how I figured out that it's easier to do it while it's flat. To cut the handles for the basket, I'm going to come in and I'm using my small oval punch. And I'm just coming in and making sure I have it centered right to left. And I've come in a little bit. This, by the way, makes a great Easter egg for another project. And then to line it up with the other side, I'm just holding it down like this, coming in and punch. And that's how I get the matching handles. Now to stick this all together, what you're going to do is you're going to take your adhesive and you're going to come and do a U on the wide fold. Just like that. And on the right hand tab, you're going to put a little bit of adhesive right there. I'll show you why in just a minute. So again, you're going to do a U. and just a little bit of adhesive on the right tab. What I do now is to stick it together, I'm going to line up this edge with this and just stick it together. This side comes inside and that's why you have that little bit of adhesive because it's going to stick it in, stick it together. There's the other side of the basket. Again, I've got the right side in first. I line up the corners, bring this tab in, line up the corners, and there's my little basket. Again, here is the decorated version and the instructions that I used to make this basket. Thank you for watching my video. I appreciate it, and I hope you'll come back to see more projects made with the envelope punch board.